Pee Wee or something to Mr. Hooviews. Today I'm doing Stargirl Shiv Part 1. And yeah, this is the first uh, two part in the series on the Pahas, Courtney, and the three new members of the FA. Uh, well, trying to get them to do some uh, teamwork or just getting them uh, like a lowdown on uh, some of the members of uh, the Injustice Society and I think they can uh, models of them to practice their or train their powers. But uh, Corny takes them down while giving everybody else uh, a chance to. It seems like she's all gun ho and thinking to some take down the Justice Society herself, even though she got recruits to do this. And uh, she actually makes friends with the, uh, Sydney, the daughter of uh, a King, uh, no, a Dragon King. And she seems to be like a bit of a control freak. Not just in school, but in her house as well, since she actually threatens her stepmother to tell her dad that she's uh, being mean to her or something. And she will get punished. And she isn't really that be that sympathetic with the uh, Henry since he wants to go to the Hogan dance, but he wants to spend more time with his dad in the hospital, but he really having it. And she does want to be in the Angel Society, but the uh, Dragon King is really letting her. And uh, seeing Corn kind of mirror or a uh, similar piece of her with uh, Dragon King just uh, giving out to Sid Sydney at the same time Pat giving to get out to Courtney about the the teamwork and that. Um what the else? Um I I do kinda like seeing where uh, Pat is, is giving the lowdown on the Angel Society members and for some of them, a uh, corny is correcting them, correcting him. Oh. And uh, let's see, uh, this one kid asks uh, uh, Courtney to the homecoming dance when she's supposed to uh, hang out with uh, Sydney. I don't know if it's, a, if it's another uh, kid of the Angel Society since his dad said that uh, someone else was a uh, Courtney. His the kid's mother before a uh, he did and said in a jokey way that he killed him, but you know. Um, there's another another hint with the gender being part of the society, but I'm more guessing that he's probably shining night, it's not the uh, uh, Doctor Faison's and. Uh, there is an episode called Shining Night that's coming in a few weeks, maybe four of them, I don't know. They really check the uh, restate. Um, turns out that uh, Mike is uh, a bit angry that uh, Pat and Courtney are spending a lot of time with each other and does tell Courtney that he and Pat went through a lot of stuff that she doesn't know about, so I wonder what that is. And um, so yes, he overhears uh, the principal talking about uh, waking up a uh, brainwave. Um, they just follow her down, and that's just when uh, uh, Sydney sees a uh, star girl and puts on her suit and comes a uh, shiv and it get it feels fight with Courtney loses but the uh, she has done the killer. I do kinda of like that the, the staff actually runs to try to find a pat and he just finds that Courtney on the ground battered and beaten. And uh Yeah that's uh, kinda of it for the episode it is good and for the second pair I'm taking either Pat is going to try to stop uh, 
corny for me in the stereo again, or maybe corny that Constance uh, wavers after uh, the build she got. Oh, and also like uh, this scene with the Angel Society when one remember the suggestion they bring their kids into this, but they think that the fever is uh, against it, since saying her son is that uh, too uh, timid or whatever to be a part of this. And I think Tigers is saying like she's coddling him too much. Yeah, I can't make out who it was. I do kind of find it interesting that uh, Dragon King is saying that Sydney is his greatest experiment. So, was he like a test tube baby or something? I was getting uh, that kind of vibe when he was saying that, but. Mm. And I do kind of like uh, the opening of it with showing the, uh, the new J JSA members. Uh, training a little and the song uh, Taking Care of Business is playing this is a song and uh, yeah it's sort of corny is they're understandable so he just wants to do a, a big a quick train since he doesn't know uh, how many people in the society is going to hurt like you get like what he wants to do quickly but I do understand that Pat's point of view want the kids to actually know their enemy and have their information and have, and just said uh, do a teamwork since that might uh, be able to help them along the way and help them sur to survive uh, longer but I don't know and uh, let's see what else oh yeah and uh, Henry's uh, telepathy is a uh, Manifesting more, and turns out the king, oh, wait, uh, a dragon king, that he uh, got his uh, door to be him to just to keep an eye on him and see if he is going to uh, develop the same powers as Brainwave. And I think it shows that he does. Is there an episode called Brainwave Junior? And for that episode called Brainwave, so. Uh, I just wonder if the uh, high school junior is going to show up and um, maybe that's the guy that uh, asked Courtney out. I don't remember his name. I don't know. But, mm. um, the, yeah, good episode and the uh, next one seems like it's going to be good as well. Uh, I'll take that. I'm going to see you guys later.